Hi guys, welcome to Chibos and Math Physics. I'm taking you through part four. Part four, yeah, part four. Limit. We are still on limit, continuity, and discontinuity. Yeah. I try to do some verification and find out whether the limit as it turned to the left and as it turned to the right, whether they are continuous. So you balance it. In physics, there is this we call balance force and unbalanced force. But let's see whether this limit continues or discontinues. And uh, I hope you will enjoy it. If you are new to this channel, kindly subscribe so that you will be notified uh, each time we upload a new video at Busomart uh, Physics. Let us jump into it. Here we are given an equation to discuss the continuity of a function f of x at x equals to 1 uh, given that the function x if x is less than 1 and uh, if x plus 2 yeah, when x is greater than equal to 1 uh, the solution to this question we from part 3 and part 2 uh, which is from part 1 you see how we uh, solve a limit and its continuity if first of all you need to determine from the left and from the right and try to solve and find the solution so here we see that from the left hand side we have uh, one but now this one is going to we are going to work it based on the negative side based on the left hand side that is why we have this negative sign here so the limit as x turn to one from the negative is equals to x which means that x is just 1 so just put x to be 1 and the limit as x turn to uh, 1 from the positive is x plus 2 meaning that 1 plus 2 will give you 3 1 plus 2 will give you 3 uh, so uh, the limit as x turn to 1 from the negative side which is 1 is not equal to the limit as x turn to 1 from the positive side, which is 3. So what is our conclusion? The limit does not exist and neither continuous or discontinuous. The second question is to discuss the continuity of this function f of x at x equals to 1. Uh, given that our function x, if x is, is not equal to 1, and 2 if x is equal to 1, what are we going to do? So like we did previously, the limit as x turn to 1 from the negative is x, which means x is 1. And the limit as x turn to 1 from the, pos uh, from the positive side is 2. Therefore, since f of x, uh, since f of, v, f of 1 is 2, because we are finding the limit as x turn to 1, from the positive so we can conclude that f of 1 uh, is equals to 2 and f of 1 is not equal to 2 why because f of 1 we got a 1 and we also have 2 so if you have these two answer that contradict each other it means that the function f of x is discontinuous because f of 1 is equals to 1 but 1 is not equal to 2 it is just one tricky way we use to solve limit uh, and uh, determine its continuity and discontinuity. You can uh, go back to uh, part one, part two, part three before you watch this part four uh, to help you understand the foundations and uh, what we mean when we talk about limit and its continuity. I remain your humble friend. Galagas, all the best in your study. So smart while smiling. It is just a fun. Apply logic systematically and it, you are good to go. Bye.